day, the Spanish conquistadors defeated the Incans in battles. The Incans came wearing their dress robes. And we have Pizarro on the line. I personally captured the Sapa Inca. After, w once we stormed his, once we stormed the square, I killed, I personally killed all 12 of his carriers. Grabbed him and pulled him from him, thereby capturing him. And what happened when they got to your camp? Uh, we were there. They were all in dress garb, information, just standing there, doing nothing. We we set up we set up our men hidden behind in battlements, hidden behind the structures. In order, to, we decided to do a more peaceful approach. We sent our priest to them, and and asked, and he tried to bargain them. He gave them our Bible, and what did they do? They threw it on the ground. On the ground. Of course, they said it was silly, and we were silly. It was our Bible, holy, sacred. Of course, we flood, we flooded the citadel with our, we, they, we flooded the square with our men. We, we kept killing them. All, we were, almost all of us were on horses, and they ran, scared, everywhere. It was confusing. It was like they never saw a gun or a sword before, or even horses. Very weird. And they were just running about. They thought we were even gods. What's up with that? So, you killed all of them. How did you capture the Sapa Inca? I personally captured the Sapa Inca after killing every one of his carriers. How did you treat him in prison? We just, we kept it, we let him keep his courts in his cell right over there. And on the occasion we played a, a little game of chess. Did you kill him? After we got the gold and silver that could fill an entire room, we decided we found that he killed his own brother, and despite our hospitality, decided to conspire conspire against us. To say for the least, we weren't very pleased with that. So we killed him. Of course we did it civilly. We left we blessed him and sent him to heaven. Um, thank you. Do come again to my founded city of Lima in Peru. Before the epic battle between the conquistadors and the Incas, Pizarro sent a priest to into the Zapa Inca for a final attempt to make peace. Here we are after the battle with the priest. I was appalled. The Zapa Inca was so full of himself, he went to the extent of throwing my holy book on the ground. He was surprised, but not scared. I think what surprised them the most was the way I look. The translator said that the Inca were amused by my robe. How did they react to your presence? Pizarro said that they threw the Bible on the ground! Can you tell us how you reacted to this scenario? I shouted at them for their insolence and told Pizarro and his men to attack. Once the war was on, I was awkwardly standing off to the side and getting drenched in blood. The effectiveness of the Incan sword.